A well-known Italian joint nailed for a long list of kitchen violations while a Northwest Side Chinese restaurant was found storing meat directly on the floor. Dylan Collier checks in at both businesses in tonight's Behind the Kitchen Door. We begin just east of downtown in the 1200 block of East Houston Street at a restaurant we were surprised to see on the list, the Spaghetti Warehouse. An inspector earlier this month cited the eatery after finding a cup and napkin tossed into the bulk sugar. A waitress was also seen grabbing cut lemons with her bare hands, then putting them in customers' drinks. And a toilet room door in the kitchen area would not close all the way. Final score? A failing 65. We do you guys want to the kitchen I want to. We're here about the failed health inspection. Uh -huh. A tour of the kitchen showed us that most of the issues were fixed, but that restroom door still seemed to have trouble closing. The president of Spaghetti Warehouse told us over the phone he's embarrassed by the failed inspection and is now working with the city to make things right. Beijing Express in the 5200 block of Fredericksburg Road near the medical center had a mildew buildup inside its ice machine. A waitress was caught making drinks for customers using a hand sink faucet, and meat placed on the floor was covered in lint and dust. Restaurant staff later threw it away. Final tally, a 63. Hi. An employee on duty didn't seem to be bothered by the low score. Can you tell us why meat was being stored on the floor? Oh, that's because we hired a new guy. He worked only like part time. He started and he didn't know what to do. A follow up inspection earlier this week found no repeat violations. For Behind the Kitchen Door, Dylan Collier, KSAT 12 News.